So what's happening guys and gals welcome back to my channel again I'm Cemil Turan and, and I'm, uh, as you might have realized I'm I'm a bit uh, I have a bit uh, flu like symptoms because of the booster uh, shot of the COVID-19 vaccine and today I'm gonna uh, discuss and tell you how to get the cheapest vitamin D3 possible so uh, this video uh, isn't meant for uh, telling how important the vitamin D3 is or uh, the or anything like uh, discussing the benefits or uh, health impacts or positive health impacts of the vitamin D3 so let's begin uh, an injectable vitamin D ampules are also suitable for oral use and they contain uh, in my country uh, in Turkey, we have uh, David 3 ampules that contain th uh, 300,000 IUs per ampule, and that ampule contains just 1 ml. So, if you uh, make, uh, make the math and make the calculations, you can see that uh, it only uh, the cost per IU is less than 1 cent or even one tenth of cent so it's quite cheap also the uh, there are same branded or uh, other vitamin d3 uh, products that they might be even uh, they might be different they might they might have a different brand but uh, they generally uh, have uh, 10 to 15 mls of uh, fluid in the bottle dropper bottle and uh, the 25 drops are generally equal to 1 ml so the question uh, that i've asked in the past is why not to take vitamin d3 ampules in a different dropper so i can or anybody can get it with a uh, with a much cheaper price so let's make the calculations again as i said we, uh, i said that uh, 20 uh, one one twenty fifth of the vitamin 3 ampule has one ml so uh, one drop of the uh, one drop of the vitamin D3 ampule has 12,000 IUs, and that's quite a uh, high dose, especially considering the uh, highest tolerable, highest daily tolerable dose or consumption is 1,000 IUs, and it differ differs. Uh, research to research but it, it seems like it is somewhere between the 4,000 and 10,000 so uh, if you take uh, one drop of that vitamin D3 ampule every other day you will get 6,000 IU per day so I did a quick calculations of the prices for the viewers or my dear viewers from different countries in order them to understand it better one-fifth of the vitamin d3 ampule it's this it, it is the exact same thing of uh, consuming one drop every other day the cost is 0.6 cents and as you can see there are other branded uh, vitamin d3 products and they can be either in droppers or capsules and the cost of it drastically increases compared to vitamin d3 ampules and even the cost even uh, increases drastically in uh, supplements by supplements i mean not pharmaceutical products or, or the products that cannot be prescribed for physicians that are covered by SGK uh, by the way SGK is the equivalent of uh, 
not technically the equivalent, but roughly the same thing as uh, NHS in UK. So you can get that. You can see that you can uh, this supplement uh, vitamin D three in supplement forms are actually mm, much pricey than the amp ampules and that price is somewhere it is up to 30 times so in other words you can get vitamin 3 d3 up to 30 times cheaper by using ampules so there are let's compare the pros and cons of the pharmaceutical vitamin d vitamin d pros are you get exactly what you pay for there you cannot get overdose or underdose products it's often much cheaper than the supplements and there is no contamination they are tightly highly regulated they get produced in tightly regulated factories so cons are none literally none you can as i said you can get it over 20 times cheaper with pharmaceutical vitamin d especially especially with vitamin d3 ampules and you might uh, you might have asked that what if i don't or you, you you don't want to take high dose at once such as 12000 i use or 6000 i use especially considering that you're not deficient 6000 uh, i use daily might be six uh, might be a high dose for you and the answer is you are just going to dilute the or dilute the product with the same carrier oil i.e this product i have here has uh, sunflower oil as a carrier oil so in order to do that or dilute the product what i'm going to do is just uh, put two ml of sunflower oil on top of it so i can uh, i can get the concentration down to one third of the original so instead of getting six uh, thousand i use per day i'm going to get two thousand i use per day with the same uh, with the same number of drops so let's begin the demonstration let's begin the fun part in here you can see that i have the one uh, bottle bottle of Polydon v3 and i'm just saying i unscrew the cap and remove the dropper and put it on a piece of newspaper in, or, in order not to make a mess and i'm opening the vitamin d3 and you gently gently hit it with the tip of your fingers in order oil to settle down you get a piece of tissue in order not to cut your thing cut open your fingers or your fingertips and fold it over three three or four times and open the vitamin vitamin d3 ampule so a fun fact is normally you have to clean the neck of the ampule but this time you don't have to because you're not going to inject that vitamin D3 in in sub, either subcutaneously or intramuscularly. You're just going to use it orally, and unfortunately, you cannot uh, pour it down to dropper bottles because of the, its viscosity and uh, and because of the design of the ampule. So I just open the 10 milliliter syringe. And I'm going to, as you can see the fl fluid is coming into the syringe and I got, and 
and I got rid of of the 100% of the vitamin D3 and I'm going to inject it to two dropper bottle so I just push the plunger till the air in front of the air in front of the piston clears out the string so I have no I have so I have there is nothing left as you can see I push the I pull the plunger back and there is no remaining one even one drop of oil so uncap the needle for your safety before continuing the process and i'm going to put the dropper cap and screw this screwable screwable cap and that's pretty much it guys now i here as you can see i have I uh, I made my vi uh, vitamin D3 droppers at home while paying 30 times less up to 30 times less and let's say I wanted to dilute the oil all I'm going to do is put that 2 cc of oil in the same dropper so thank you thank you guys for watching and let me know what you think about think about it and don't don't forget to comment share and subscribe and as always till next time take care and have a great day